This video is going to show you how to use this DTP-08 and it's common to the DTP-07 as well. It's how the catch is set to pick up these Mauser style drums. So the first thing we do is we need to set this top hook forward. So we take the pin out and we put the pin in the front hole as far forward as you can. We'll show this close up shortly. And also we have this flip down plate here. This needs to be flipped out of the way for the Mausers. So then we raise this higher than the drum and then we'll bring the unit in. So we'll show you the overall thing first. Wheel in, operate the lever here to lower the catch down. You can hear that little toggle there. This is the toggle plate here. If I just move it here, you can see that's gone underneath the lip of the drum. So we know now we can lift it. So we pump the handle and we lift the drum. The drum is full, so it weighs about 200 kilos. So now we're safe to move off to the next position. Now once we've gone to the next location and we want to put the drum down, we open this lever here anti-clockwise and that will drop the drum down. Now you can see here this little toggle. Now what we need to do is we push the unit forward to create some space and we lift off the catch. That's it. So it's very simple. So that's catch connected, push the unit forward, raise it off and away we go. Now if we let this rack assembly go down too far then the catch will get stuck on the lip. So let's do that now. So let's lower it down so all the weight is on there. So now I can't take this catch off. Even if I push it forward I still can't get it off. So what I do then is I just raise the catch so I can see it there just raise it up. That allows me to release the catch from the unit. We're now going to show you a close-up of the catch connecting to the drum. So we wheel in, we then lower down the catch, as soon as this toggle you can see here has gone underneath the lip we can then pump the hydraulics and lift the drum. Now. If we lower down the catch by opening the release valve, we can lower it down. Now you can see here, this is loose. We push the unit forward and release the catch. Now, the next thing we'll show you is if we do it wrong, where we, let's reconnect a moment. Now if we open up the release valve and lower the rack down, you see the rack's gone down. So the toggle now is a long way from the lip. You can see here there's a gap underneath. And this means the hook is stuck under the lid. And I can't release it. Even if I push it forward, I still can't release it. So what we do then is keep your fingers clear, operate from the back of the unit. And we limp, simply pump the hydraulic handle to raise up. This creates space us to release. We've now removed the catch from the depalletizer so you can have a closer look at it. And this top hook assembly here you can see is retained by this pin. So this pin can be taken out and we can fit this in this hole, this hole or this hole by moving it down these positions. So for a tight head steel we would put it in here, for a Mauser it goes in here. So it's very easy to change. So again we just slacken down allow enough space for the toggle before we release and move back the unit. Now we're going to show you this small Mauser. So this isn't your 200 litre, this is about your 120 litre. So what we've got now is we need to reset this catch in a lower position. So if we lower the hydraulics all the way down, so this is all the way down now, you'll notice when we come into this drum if we just pull the unit forward, you can see the toggle, it doesn't go low enough to go underneath the lip. 
So what we need to do is we need to actually lower the catch assembly down to the next ladder rung position. It's very easy to do, very quick. We take off the catch and then we slot it in one position lower and reinstall the pin. Then we pump the handle, just like normal, so the catch is above the drum. We then wheel in the unit. We open up a hydraulic valve till the toggle has now dropped below the rim of the drum. We then pump the handle again to lift the drum up. Then we manoeuvre the unit away. Now, when we want to lower the drum down, again, operate this handle, lower it down. And as soon as the weight is off the drum, you can see here the toggle is free. Again, push the unit forward. And as you push it forward, you create more of a gap to lift off the catch. 